morning. I'm Gina, and today I'm going to report the headline that happened during the night. Last night, the murderer carried a knife to the victim's house and killed him. Why did the murderer do such cruel thing? The police are still investigating, and we will report the latest news for you later. Do you know why you're here? Do you know who this guy was? Why do you kill an innocent person? Why do you kill this guy? I ask one more time. Why did you kill him? Why did Joanna kill someone? All this has to be traced back to the family environment. Before Joanna went out of society, at Joanna's young age, her father always drink and gamble. Therefore, he owed a debt out there. He often aggressively beat Joanna and her mother when he was in such a bad mood. Joanna determinedly left the house. She had lived for a long time. After graduating from junior high school and lived independently, from then on, she worked in a restaurant. However, it didn't take too long. One day, she got desperate news of her mom's illness from the phone. In order to treat her mom's illness and pay off her father's day, she borrowed one million from her boss Alice to her family. It wasn't until she was threatened with violence she realized that her boss had forced her to pay off a high debt. Joanna was threatened and beaten every day, and bloody by hatred and filled with grudge. So she had to kill her boss, Alice. Why did I kill him? Why would I do such a thing? This kind of bastard shouldn't exist in this world at all. Killing him can make the world better. <laughs> <laughs> Today's discussion about the murder of Alex is becoming more and more intense, and the public is also beginning to pay attention to this case. Because of this, our news station interviewed the prosecutor of this case and the defense lawyer of this suspect in order to make the public more aware of this case. Now, let's listen to their opinions. Next, I will give you an explanation of this case for the media. The police have found the initial confirmation. The cause of Alex's death has been proven that he was stabbed, stabbed in the back by the murderer. For this case, the prosecution will continue to follow up and give you everyone a justice result. Thanks for the prosecutor's speech. Let's take a look at the views of the lawyer who defends the suspect, Joanna. No matter how much evidence the police collect in the outcome of this case, I will come into my greatest responsibility to defend for my client, Joanna. To me, no matter who she is, she must be protected by the justice of the law. This is my duty as the lawyer. Above all are the explanations of the prosecutor and the defense lawyer on this case. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Gina, and I wish you peace and goodbye.
Hello, everyone. I'm Gina, and I will continue to report the murder of Alex for you. Today, the police sent the suspect Joanna to the Taipei District Court for further trial. And her family background also caused widespread discussion due to this case. Next, hand a shot to the special correspondent and listen to what people say. Hello, I am the special correspondent Alice. Next, I'm going to interview people about the murder of Alex. I feel like the murderer is a good man, so the victim might have been done something to make the murderer desperate. It's not what she wants to be born in his family. Come on, domestic violence. You mean like violence? Yeah. Family is not reason to murder someone. Come on, who care what happened to the murder in the past? There is no need to kill someone. Even if she was forced to get the um, you can call the police. So what if they are doing something blood-hearted? Mm, it's better than killing. It's a it. The above is the report of all the interviews. I'm the special correspondent Alice. Next, let's switch back to the reporter Gina. Thanks to the special correspondent Alice for this report. That is the morning news for today. I'm Gina. I believe you all know the purpose of coming here. Alex, the restaurant owner, was murdered. The defendant, Joanna, was charged with murder. That night, when police arrived at the scene, they found that Alex was dead, and Joanna was standing in front of the body with a murder weapon beside her. That's how it happened. Thank you. Okay, the defendant lawyer, do you have anything to say? Yes, according to the investigation, my client was forced to do this because she was frightened by victim's money and violence. But she cannot commit the act of murdering a victim. If everyone can, then where is the justice of the law? But even if she is sentenced to death, she cannot save this person's life. Then what is the meaning of this? According to the article 271 of criminal law of the Republic of China, a person who kills another shall be punished with death. However, Article 251 of Criminal Law of the Republic of China also points out the meaning of sentences is life imprisonment or more than 10 years imprisonment. Not to mention that my client is not a natural killer. She committed such a crime because she was persecuted. What about the rights of the victim? You just keep talking about how innocent a defendant was. What about a victim? Quiet, quiet. I have made my decision and that is... I know you are thinking why the film ends here. In fact, we hope the result of the trial depends on your decision. Murderers are not necessarily innocent, and victims are not necessarily innocent as well. I hope this video will make you pay more attention to this topic. There are two sides in every person. No one is outsider.